Okay, we're recording. So I'm just going to have this recorded for anybody who can't make it. Um, and then, okay, it looks like somebody just joined on. I just wanted to make sure. Um, okay, so first thing I want to do, there she is. Hey, Ruth, Anne, how are you? Okay, I'm going to mute you. I don't know if I can. Just give me one second. There we go. Okay, so sorry, guys. I don't mean to cut you guys off when you come in. I just want to keep the, no the noise background down. So I want to first start off, um, before we get into anything, with some recognition. I want you guys to know how amazing July was because... Um, July can be typically, typically seen as like a slower time in your business. And, um, you know, you guys literally like rock the heck out of July. So I really just want to quickly touch on how awesome it was. We had 23,000, almost 23,000 in group sales in July, which is pretty, pretty dang amazing. Uh, we welcomed nine new consultants and our group was an official 118 in July, which is super awesome. Um, our new consultants, just a quick shout out if you're on the call or if you are watching the playback, uh, we have Christine Marcianic from Levittown, New York, Casey Graham from Tilton, Illinois, Margaret Lynn from Woodbury, New York, Danielle Manzel from Waterford, Waterford, sorry, Michigan, Rebecca Franzese from Holbrook, New York, Stacy Brock from Claremont, Florida, uh, Vanessa Bermudez, Levittown, New York, Danielle Riccio, North Massapequa, New York, um, Angela Santana, Valley Stream, New York. Awesome. I love all those New Yorkers we got in there. Um, and then... Some of the top sales. So I'm going to recognize this, the six, Sweet 16 in um, both Real Consultants and Waxinistas. So the, um, the top sales for the Real Consultants team was Mei Wong, um, Patricia Morrow, Nicole Hubbard, Rebecca Franzese, T uh, Danielle Manzel, Rebecca... Lisetis, I always say your last name wrong if you're on here. Nicole Scheel, Laura Cologne, Sarah Arnold, Lauren Fritas, Margaret Lynn, Vanessa Bermudez, Lindsay Schmidt, Stephanie Smith, Chrissy Camelone, and Jennifer Hicks. Woohoo! <laughs> and then Waxanisa Sweet 16, we had Amanda uh, Hibbard, Nicole Hubbard, Desiree Varick Chia, Amber Nab, <laughs> Jenna Barrett. Christy Vieira, I'm sorry, Amber Warner, Ruth Ann Renner. I know we got Ruth Ann on the call. Look at her make a sweet 16. Um, we got Samantha Murad, Amber Reichard, Christina Ludgebly, Ludgebly, <laughs> Sarah Scully, Kayla Mason, Catherine Sass, Barbara Couchimai, sorry, and Allison Lopez. So congratulations to all our top sales. And then, um, yeah, so we had a pretty awesome um, July, you guys, like July was insane. So I just wanted to give a little bit of shout outs and recognition to those, um, top sales in July. We had some team builders in July. Um, we have myself, P Patricia Morrow, Laura Cologne with two team members, Christina Marcianic, um, Sarah Weaver, May Wong, and Erica Craig, all sponsored people in July, which is awesome. Um, and we had that warmer special too, which was really cool. Um, and then let me see some promotions that we have certified consultant, Teresa Blair, Amanda Hibbard, Christina Ledgebly, Andrea Kraft, Rebecca Vlicidius, <laughs> Francine Carbonell, and Kayla Lerma, all to certified lead consultants were Lindsay Schmidt, May Wong, and Christy Vieira. Um, star consultant was Amber Knapp. And, um, yeah, that was it. Those are the promotions that we had. So anyway, I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of recognition because you guys are super awesome and I want you to know how amazing you are. So, oh, we got new, new people on here. Hey, Tiffany. Oh, I'm so glad we got all these people on here. I think this is the most participation we've ever had on a call, you guys. You know what that tells me? That tells me that you guys want to earn a trip. <laughs> all right. So let me fix my screen because I just made this like ridiculously big. All right, so, um, so there's a chat box on the side. So again, I want this call to be interactive. So if you have any questions during the things that we're going to talk about, uh, please utilize the chat box and ask me um, because I'm going to be. I want to be able to answer your questions, and that way, you know, I want all of you to get off this call feeling very confident about earning this trip. So if there's any questions you have, for sure, put in the chat box as we talk because you're all muted, so I'm not going to be able to hear you. So I'm going to quickly share my screen because I want to show you a video. Now, for those of you who attended reunion with me, like I know Lori's on here. Um, um, and we, there she goes, keep your hands on the wheel, girl. <laughs> um, so they actually showed this video at reunion. 
um, but it's also on your home screen too. So if you haven't seen it, I just want to quickly show it to you because it's a video of our incentive trip, um, which is, I love it. It's super exciting. So let me just go, hold on, what just happened? Um, to the video. So it's right here on your home, t home screen, but I want to quickly share it with you guys. Let me see if it'll do this. Oh, wait. Can you see it? Whoa. Lower, lower, lower. Did, were you guys even able to see that? Let's be real. I hope that like, because I hit the full screen and hopefully you were able to see that. Um, so I just want to show you guys that because I, I literally watched that video the other day like three times in a row because I was just like, bow, 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 bow. I mean, like, this is going to be me on the boat. I'm be dancing, I'm zip lining on the boat. <laughs> that video just gets me pumped. I don't know if it's the music, but I'm so excited for this freaking trip, you guys. Like, this is a trip of a lifetime. To be able to, like, go on a Mediterranean cruise to Spain, France, Italy, like, it's ridiculous. So I want you guys to know that you have an opportunity right here to do that, okay? And each one of you are very, very capable of earning this trip, okay? Let me start by saying that when I joined Sensi, um, I joined right in the middle of the qualification period. So our qualification period starts from August 1st and goes through January 31st. I joined October 1st, dead smack in the middle, and I earned a Disney trip for my Myself and my family um, in three months. Um, well, I was able to take my family to Disney, but I was able to buy them in, but I earned the trip for myself within three months time of joining. So it is very attainable. Um, you just have to um, you know, be willing to work at it and just like have that goal in mind. So whatever your, you know, level is that you want, and we're going to talk about that in a second. Um, you really have to just know, like, it's all going to start with your mindset. Every last bit of earning the Sensi incentive trip is you making a decision that you can do this. Okay. Um, you know, I can sit here and tell you how, you know, how to go about it and how to earn it. But if you don't fully and truly believe in it in yourself that you have the capability to earn a trip like this, then you're not going to earn it. So you have to, you have to first say to yourself, I want this trip and I'm going to do it and I'm going to do everything I can to earn it. And you know what? If it happens where you don't earn it, 
wouldn't you feel so much better knowing you put your all in and you tried versus you just like automatically putting on a blind or like, yeah, no, I'd never earn that. I'm just not that of that status. You know, like I just won't earn it. I am just like you. I go back to certified consultant every month, just like the rest of us. Okay. And I have to continually work my business and make my numbers in order to get paid a title and all that stuff, just like you guys do. So there, I have no advantage over you. We literally, the only difference is, is that I joined Sensi before you. That's the only difference. But as far as like earning a trip, we all have the same ability as earning a trip. Okay. Um, so before I get into everything, um, the other day when we had our team hangout, I know a lot of people were like, Oh, I wish I was more local. I want you guys to know that, um, there goes my daughter crying. So sorry, this is real life. Um, unfortunately it's the way that the cookie crumbles. She, she, well, that's the way the cookie crumbles too, but, um, you know, we're spread out all over the U S. So anybody who's local to me, I do a local team hangout. If you have, um, like your sponsor or your upline, actually the only upline you have here other than Nicole. So if like you're in Nicole's area um, and she's your director, you could always talk to her and see like if she's forming any types of team hangouts or gatherings, but it's very important for you to get together in those things because um, you know, hearing from other people who understand you or is really going to help you. So of course, like people who are local, we do that, but that's why I do a monthly team call such as this one for everybody who's not local to us. And I know that you guys saw this when I posted this the other day and everybody was like, oh my God, I want that. So this was a trip, um, a trip earner's manual. Hey, 80. Hi. <laughs> She's so cute. I miss you. <laughs> um, so yeah, so this is a trip earners manual that I put together for all of our local team members that came here, but I love you guys just as much. So what I'm doing is I created this document. It's a one page doc or one document with all the files in it where you'll be able to print it out. Okay. And you can either put it in something like this or you can put it in a folder, but it'll be there to help you, uh, to help guide you along into earning the incentive. Okay. So before, um, let me see, what am I going to talk to you about? I definitely want to go with the, like the qualifications and start that because that's important to know. But before I get into the qualifications, I want you guys to think about August right now, okay? Because we literally just kicked off the, the, the qualification period, August 1st. So we are already seven days, a full week into August. We are in full swing in earning this incentive and we're a full swing into August. And we have some amazing specials. So I'm gonna go over this. If this is repetitive for you right now, maybe you already know this, I apologize, but we also have a lot of new consultants and so I just wanna make sure you guys are fully prepared. So I'm gonna share my screen. <clears throat> and forgive me, I have wine. And again, if you guys have questions, put them in the chat box. Um, okay. So this month is 10% off sale. Okay. So for newer consultants, we transition from um, the spring and summer to the fall winter catalog in August. And then we do the same thing in February with the fall to the spring catalog. So if you go on your marketing tab, um, whoops, now I got logged out. Um, your marketing tab, you'll see here the all the discontinued items, okay, discontinued items for fall winter 2017. If you click this out, this is everything that is in the, that is being discontinued this month. So you really, really need to make sure you are sharing this with your customers. Um, you know, everybody, share it on social media, bring it to your parties. Like I have a couple home parties this month, I'm printing these out. And I'm taking them with me because you want people to know about that, okay? So we have 10% off sale. We have items being discontinued. Um, bundles are included in the 10% off. So like six packs, um, what is it? Six packs, three packs, things like that. The only bundles that aren't included, like the combine and saves, is the companion system and the perfect Sensi system, the ones with the asterisk. But the, um, the Sensi system is, and then licensed and charitable items, so like the MLB warmers and the NCAA warmers, and then all sale and closeout items and charitable items are not on sale, okay? So just so you know, just to give you an idea, if you're new at Sensi and you don't know. So um, definitely go ahead and print this out and refer to it because you're gonna need to know, if you have a customer, just a side note, you know, who purchased, uh, you know, flower child from you over the spring and summer or the past couple months, you're going to want to follow up with them by saying, Hey girl, flower child's being discontinued. I really want you to know. I know you love that scent. You purchased it however long ago, like it's going out. So you can do that by literally searching every single one of these scents on your workstation. If you go to your orders tab and you just search right in here, 
you guys. Um, order history, and then if you could just search right here. So if I was to put in flower child, and I know that like you may think this is irrelevant to the trip, but this is because like I said, I wanna make sure you guys are fully set up for August. Um, you click search, and then this is, this is everybody who has ever purchased that scent from you. So if you were to open it up, you'd see like whoever purchased it and then you'd contact them and be like, you know, like my hostess bought this and I'd be like, oh, hey, I know you got that. She might turn around and be like, oh my God, I love that scent. I'm going to stock up on a six pack or she might say no, but at least, you know, you went out there. So that's something that I do during transition month every season, every catalog season. I always go through all the discontinued scents, okay? Um, as far as Scentsy Family store items, you're going to want to make sure if you haven't gotten out already, you're going to need for the fall to purchase testers and catalogs. If you don't purchase anything else, you need testers and catalogs. That's it. Um, you know, you don't need a keychain from the Scentsy Family store. You don't need the tumbler that says Scentsy on it. I mean, it's very cute, but if you're looking to, you know, spread your dollar wide, you want to make sure that you are getting what you need. And what you need is testers and catalogs. So right now, a transition set of mini testers is on sale for $12. The party testers are on sale for $20. So what you're going to do when you get like your, your testers that you have now as a consultant now, everything that came in your kit, all of these are going to be discontinued. So what you're going to do is you're going to separate all of these testers and you're going to take them out and put them to the side. And those are going to be your discontinued items and so or discontinued scents. And these are the scents that you're going to share this month if you do parties like and you have all the, the, the scents out. You want to have those separate so that people know those are being discontinued. Once you take all of these out of your testers, everything else that's left is going into the new fall catalog. It's it's rolling over, okay? Because a lot of the scents remain the same like sun Citrus and, um, you know, Jammy Time. Like those ones are going back in. So the transition set is what you want because that's going to be all of the new fall and winter scents plus any returning fall and winter scents that are going back in the, in the new catalog okay so that's just a heads up so if you're going to spend anything at the Sensi family store definitely get uh, testers and catalogs um you probably also want to you definitely want to get catalogs okay um hold on let's see here yeah, so the, you definitely want to get the catalogs. You might want to get a product training guide for yourself because this is going to explain um, more about each product, how to sell them. They give you like selling points and selling tips and stuff like that. So you could, I would definitely pick up one of those for yourself just so you're knowledgeable about the products this season. But the regular catalogs are, um, where are they? I think they're $14 right now. They're on sale. Okay, so actually they're on sale for um Ten dollars. So that's awesome. It's a pack of twenty-five for ten dollars. So I would usually get like a couple sets of regular catalogs because I go through these. Um, the showcase brochures, like the larger ones, um, you want to. Why does that say? I thought that the showcase brochures. But anyway, the larger one that they're like much thinner. I tend to use those for like home parties and stuff. So I'll usually get a pack of those, and then I get product sheets, the ones that like rip out on the you know the one sheet those are good for mailings because they're much lighter okay so catalog testers that's what you need for the fall um so we did sff items also if you go on the news tab um what i like to do on the news tab is click here all and then you're going to see everything that's been posted on the news tab so you want to see hold on let me move this like this oops what did i just do hold on I just like lost myself. I don't know what just happened. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, okay, so I click all and it shows me this. Look how many items already today is August 7th. How many new things are on the news tab from August 7th? There's one, two, three, four, five, six things have been posted on our news tab today, you guys. So this is why you have to check the news tab daily, especially now that we're in fall season and especially this month, okay? Like, look at this. They're having a giveaway to get a Scentsy Body collection. So you got to share this with your customers and let them know. So always, always check your news tab, okay? Um, um, so there's a Sensi Family Store sale. Oh, so that's what I was going to show you. Hang on. I want to like move this thing. Um, where is it? It's shop the Sensi Family Store. Was that it? Sorry. It's, um, whatever this is, it's something about savings on a Scentsy Family Store. But anyway, yeah, see, this one is just the like, reunion attendees. Um, but anyway, this is where you would go, and it tells you there, it tells you what's on sale at the Scentsy Family Store. And then also, um, 
yeah, I don't know, whatever. So anyway, just go on your news tab. I'm not going to keep you guys long here, but it'll show you what's on sale at the Sensi Family Store if you really want to go look, or you go on Sensi Family Store and see what's on sale, okay? So 10% off sale. There's um, the Sensi Family Store sale this month. We also have Sensi Go coming. So for those of you who were at reunion, you have the option to pre-sell um, five bundles of the Scentsy Go, and you guys know that already. And then for those of you who are not at reunion, you just need to go ahead and start collecting pre-orders for September 1st. So don't think that just because you weren't at reunion that you can't collect pre-orders. Go on Facebook and find pictures of Scentsy Go. You know what I do? I go on Facebook and I use it like Google, and I'll type in Scentsy Go and watch what comes up. Then you go photos. And look at all these photos, like, of Scentsy Go. So I'll take this, and I'll literally, I know it's bad, but I'll take, like, images that I see that other people have posted. I mean, granted, like, you also want to stand out, but at the same time, if you don't have the product, go ahead and find a picture, like a live picture, because you don't want to, you know, nobody's going to be really get the feel. So share these images as much as you can. Try and collect pre-orders for September, okay? Because this is going to be a hot item. This is literally, like, a, a freaking fragrance, fragrance revolution. It's insane, okay? 10% um, off. Scentsy Family Store sale, Scentsy Go. Bar increases are going up to you guys September 1st. Um, our bars are going up to keep up with the cost of inflation. Um, on September 1st, they're going up to $6. So make sure you start letting your customers know that too so that they could take advantage while getting the bars at an inexpensive price too, okay? Um, and then what else is going on? I have like, my brain is just like all over the place. 10% um, off Scentsy Family Store. Sensi Go. There was something else I was going to tell you that's going on this month that I totally didn't even write down. Um, oh, enhanced dirt. Hello, enhanced starter kit. So we have an amazing kit this month. So you guys really need to be sharing the opportunity um, this month. Join in August. Here we go. Um, yeah, so this month they can choose. So the way that this kit works, it's normally a $99 kit. And again, if this is repetitive for you, I apologize. But again, I'm doing this because we have a lot of new consultants, okay? Um, but if they join in August, um, normally during, during transition month, we have an enhanced kit where they can have everything that comes in a regular $99 kit plus the uh, fall and winter testers and catalogs. And that's what it is. It's not a double kit. It's an enhanced kit, okay? But this month, they get the option of having choosing the regular $99 enhanced kit that includes all of that or the enhanced kit plus a diffuser. So they're basically getting, and an oil, they're basically getting a diffuser and an oil for, for $49, which is amazing because a diffuser is $130 on its own. So I've really been making sure that I'm sharing the business opportunity with anybody. And again, these are things that are going to help you into earning your incentive ultimately anyway, okay? So make sure you guys are really sharing the business opportunity with people, okay? Um, and then we also have our team challenge this month, too, in relation to that. So every person that you sponsor in August in our team challenge, it's open to everyone in our group, you get an entry um, into a drawing for winning a Sensi Go for yourself. Um, and then the one with the, the person with the most... Um, recruits is going to get a diffuser shade from the new catalog okay so that's just fyi we have that um team incentive going on this month okay um so those are some things that are going on this month this month is crazy all right so let's start talking about the incentive so i want to pull up the trip so just bear with me here um and i just want to see if there's any questions real quick okay so if you guys have questions by the way just let me know. Okay. Um, okay. So I want to pull up the trip now. Let me just see here. You can earn one four of levels. Okay. So let's go over the qualifications for the trip. I want to open this here so you guys can see it. All right. So in order to earn a Sensi incentive, you need, you need to have a plan. You cannot just go into this hoping you earn this, you guys, because I'm telling you, it's just going to be much harder. So you want to make sure you have an actual plan, okay? And that's what we're going to talk about here today. So let's talk about the incentive. What are you going to earn with the Scentsy Summer Incentive, okay? That cruise looks freaking amazing, by the way. I don't know if you guys saw in that video, you can go zip lining on a damn cruise. <laughs> they had this little thing right here. It looks like a stage. Like, they had performers on there. It's crazy. I don't know about you guys, but I'm excited. Are you guys excited? Can I get some comments? Tell me who's excited. Like, who wants to go? Actually, put in the comments what level you want to go for. Okay, so level one, you're going to get registration for your region Scentsy Family Reunion. 
Um, so this year we're doing Sensi Family Reunion in Anaheim, California, and they're including um, a get. They're including like a family day in the Disney, which by the way, the entertainment tickets are sold out. So um, Sensi, according to their newsletter, said that they are working on reaching, you know, more of a capacity there. Um, however, these things sell out really fast. So if you are thinking about going to Reunion, just as a side note, just register for it, okay? Because you have a whole year to figure it out. Um, and the worst possible scenario is that you're out $50 as long as you cancel by, by like the, the cancel date, okay? But you have a whole year to figure it out, but register and then figure it out afterwards. Because if you wait and it gets sold out, you're gonna be very upset that you, that you never registered. And I see this happen pretty frequently, okay? And but being the fact that the, those tickets just sold out, the entertainment passes, like that just gives you an idea of Sensi Family Reunion, okay? Um, so anyway, so level one, if you are level one, you're gonna get registration to Sensi Family Reunion. Registration is just your registration. It's, it includes all the general sessions, it includes um, you know all the training, the, world, the motivational speakers, the prizes, the giveaways, t-shirts, all that stuff. Um, but it's not like hotel or anything like that. Level two, if you earn it, you're going to get the incentive trip for one, um, minus your airfare and baggage. So you're going to get the cruise, but you're going to have to pay for your flight. Um, level three is all expenses paid for one, okay, for you. That's cruise, flight, everything, okay? Sensi even gives you, typically, I don't know what, the, what they'll do this year, of course, but usually they'll give you what's called per diem, which is cash on your Sensi debit card, and you, you're able to use that on your travel days for like baggage or, I mean, use it for food or whatever, but um, they usually will give you money too to spend, okay? Um, and then level four is all expenses paid trip for you and one guest, okay? So we're not gonna talk about level one and two here, we're going to be talking about levels three and four because I don't know about you guys, but if you want to earn a trip on the Mediterranean cruise and you earn level two, trip to Spain or flight to Spain, you're probably looking at like 1500 okay? So why earn a free trip with Sensi if you're going to have to go ahead and pay 1500 We are level three and four earners, you guys, okay? So I want to see real quick what you guys said. Level four, yes, that's what I'm talking about. And reunion definitely is worth a three and four and maybe if my husband, yes, guys, I love this. Oh, and I didn't even realize I could pull up the, the chat thing here. Do you get points for registering for a new reunion or if you went this year? Yeah, those points were for this year. Whoa, what just happened to my screen? It looks like there's like a green line on it. I don't know what the hell that is. Um, yeah, so level, um, yeah, the points for, for reunion are if you, if you had attended this year. So anyway, so let me um, put this here. I don't know why that green thing is here. Hang on a second. Let me try doing that again. Okay, that's better. All right, so, um, so okay, so level four, hang on, I need to like move this, there we go. So that's what it is, okay? Um, so we're gonna talk about levels three and four. Now obviously, you know, it's not to say that if you would rather do reunion and that's where you wanna go, that's, that's fine. You have to think about your goal. What is your goal here? Um, so I want you guys to write that down. Like think about whatever that, whatever that goal is that you want. But I'm telling you like, if you don't push yourself that much further, and you just settle at level two, let's say, because you don't think you're capable of earning level three or four, then you're not, it, it's gonna be even that much harder to get to level two. If you set your, your goals a little bit higher, you're gonna push that much, that much harder to get there, okay? Um, so this is what it takes. You're, you basically get credits um, between the qualification period for you to earn the incentive, okay? And your credits are determined upon sales, recruiting, personal promotions, consistency, getting paid at your title, um, things like that. Okay, so in order to earn a Sensi incentive, you need to have high sales and recruiting. High sales and recruiting, high sales and recruiting. That's literally like basically what it breaks down to and consistency, of course, okay? Um, so get it out of your mind right now that you can't do this because you're on this call for a reason because you want to know how, and I'm going to tell you how to do that. Since I've been with Sensi, I've earned every single incentive, and I'll tell you, it is not hard. It just takes dedication, it takes focus, and it takes you willing, or you having the belief in yourself to know that you can do this, okay? Because I'll tell you, if you don't have that belief now, 
come up, come like November, October, all of a sudden you might get the fire in you again because all of a sudden fall is going to be amazing and you're going to be doing great and you're going to get burnt out because now you only have three months to sit here and try and earn a, a cruise that you've been waiting to, to, um, to try. Um, hold on. I need to mute somebody that just came on. Um, okay. Sorry. So anyway, so here's how the credits work, okay? So in order to qualify, you need credits. So for level one, you need 15,000 credits. For level two, you need 20,000. Level three, 25,000. And, and level four, 30,000. Um, when you're looking at that, you're probably like, uh, like, okay, I need 30,000 credits. Like, I'm never going to do that. So this is why we break it down. And this is why it's important to have a trip plan so that you don't get overwhelmed, okay? Um, then you have... I don't know what's going on, why this keeps happening. Hang on. I have to, like mute somebody right here. I don't know what's going on. Who's not muted? Can you guys just make sure your things are muted if you don't mind, just because I'm getting like a, a feedback on here. Anyway, so credits, um, <laughs> what this is here, credits needed from activities other than personal sales. So the reason why Sensi does this is so that people don't buy in their points to earn an incentive, okay? Because let's be real it could be very easy for somebody who's making a lot of money with Sensi to say, you know what, I'm just going to spend 15000 over this or 30000 over this next six months on myself and I'm going to earn that trip. So that's why Sensi does that because you need these credits um, need to come, like a portion of your credits need to come from things other than your own PRV and sales. So that's why they do that, okay? So you can see here on the left what those what those credits need to be, okay? So monthly sales. For every point you earn in PRV, you will earn one credit toward your incentive trip, okay? So again, it's the same thing with the PRV you sell. Every dollar you sell um, equals to one point in PRV. Um, and then they said, but be aware that there are also non-PRV credit requirements. Um, building your team, which is something that would be, would be considered as non-PRV. So anything that's not sales is considered non-PRV, okay? The nice thing about sales, though, you guys, is PRV, is that it's free points. You literally have no cap on the amount of, of uh, PRV points that you can give yourself during the qualification period, okay? As long as you're willing to work at it and hustle and, you know, make a plan and stick to it, you can definitely get, um, you know, get your, your PRV points up there. So what you're going to get um, for your frontline, does anybody know what frontline means? Let me see. Put it in the chat box. If you know what your frontline is, I want to know. Will I take a sip of wine? Let's see if it pops up. Where's my chat box, by the way? Anybody? Does anybody know what your front line is? I really want to know. I told you guys, I wanted this call to be interactive. We got to be talking because we're not here. People who register under you. Um, yes, very close. People who, sp yes, I know what you mean. So people you personally sponsor, those are your front line, okay? So you have a conversation with someone, they join with you, you are their sponsor. That, they are considered your front line. Anybody under you, under them rather, is considered your down line, just to give you guys an, um, an idea, okay? So front line consultants. So, what? No, I'm on a call, Dylan. Dylan, mommy's on a call. I'm so sorry, guys. She's like... Yes, go ahead, Dylan. I'm so, so sorry, guys. <laughs> this is real life. It's, it's bedtime. So anyway, so front line, you're going to get credits for anybody who you sponsor who earns at least 1,000 PRV. Now, what is 1,000 PRV? It's promoting to certified consultant, okay? So for every person who you bring on during the qualification period from August 1st, to um, January 31st, you're gonna get a thousand credits. See how it says credits earned? You're gonna get a thousand credits per, per qualifying consultant who reaches certified. Now look at this, for the who reaches certified for the first time during the qualification period, okay? Note, this is amazing, since he's being so generous here. Reinstated and restored consultants who reach certified consultant for the first time during the qualification period will count towards sponsoring credit. That is amazing. They didn't have this last year. Um, so that means if somebody was used to sell Sensi 
and all of a sudden they decide to rejoin, whether they were with you before or whether they came from, you know, someone else, but now they've decided to come to you. Um, and they weren't certified before they came back. Um, and they reached certified from August to January at some point, those credits will go to you. You get a thousand credits. Okay. So reinstated consultants, just so you guys know, if you don't know, if you used to sell Sensi, as long as it's been three months since you went inactive, you can come back to Sensi for free. So that's why a lot of times I'll reach out to people who went inactive, like who, you know, who, maybe they, they were on my team like a year ago or something like that. I might reach out to them and say, Hey girl, we have this awesome special one. I know you, you know, you joined, you know, you were, you know, a sensei consultant, however long ago, have you ever thought about getting back in it? Because it's really awesome time, blah, blah, blah. Um, you know, and if they came back and if they certified during that point, I would get the credits for that, um, which is really amazing again, because sensei normally doesn't do that. Like I've never seen them do that before. So that's really awesome. Um, I also did see in the facts. So one more thing I want to show you, because I didn't see that here. So on your home screen, um, if you go down, it tells you the credits you need, but you can either print your tracker or you click facts right here and it answers all your questions for you. Um, so it says here, um, building your team. Okay. Um, where is it? It's hold on. Let's see. Roll out. Wait, control F. Where's my thing? Oops. Ugh. Hold on. I gotta move this thing. Roll. Why is it doing that? Oh, there we go. Okay, so right here. Um, if a new frontline consultant rolls up and then hits their thousand, will I receive credits? If the frontline member earns a thousand PRV between August 1st and January and roll up to you, it would count towards your sponsoring credits. So that is another thing that's really huge that Sensi did, which is freaking amazing. Um, where's that thing that I just had now? Oh, here it is. Okay. So roll-ups. Roll-ups means if you sponsored someone and then they sponsored someone, but then that your person, your frontline went inactive, that person rolls up to you. So if they were never certified before, but they happen to certify during the qualification period, you'll get those credits. Okay. One more thing I want to tell you about the, um, the people who turned certified. If they joined in July, July 1st, 2017, but they certify in August and on, you get the credits, okay? If they, if they joined in July, but they certified in July, it's not going to count. They have to certify during the qualification period, but they are allowing if they joined in July, which is really awesome, okay? So Sensi is being really generous with these points. Anybody have questions about that? Please let me know and put it in the, um, the chat box, okay? Hold on a second. I need to click, like, clicking this here. Hold on. Sorry because I just lost my thing. All right. So, um, why does that keep happening? All right. So now, so personal promotions, when you promote for the first time, um, for the first time, like that you've ever promoted, whatever, you're going to get credits. Okay. So this is a really great way because you could promote multiple times and get all of these credits here. So the way that it works is let's say you join Sensi and you're not certified yet. If you if you personally certify in the qualification period from August through January 31st, you're going to get a thousand credits right there on your incentive. Okay. If you promote to lead consultant, you're going to get 1500 credits. If you promote to star, you're going to get 2000 credits, superstar 3000, director 5000 and so on. <clears throat> so that's how that works for the first time when you promote. The nice thing about this is if you like I've doubled promoted before when I turned lead consultant, I also hit star in that same month. So that can very well happen to you. Let's say you promote to director in six months, guys, I promoted to director in six months. Don't think it's not possible. Okay. Um, you know, these are things that we could talk about on how to do that, but literally like it can happen. So don't think it can't. So if you promote, let's say you promote to, um, to superstar consultant, right? During the qualification period, let's say you're a central consultant now and then you promote or you're a certified consultant now. And let's say you promote to superstar consultant, you're going to get 1500 credits when you promote to lead, you're going to get 2000 credits when you, when you then get star. And then when you hit superstar, you're going to get 3000 credits. That's three, four, five, six, that's 6,500 credits right there toward your incentive. So you can see how promoting is really going to help you. Okay. Um, so those are personal promotion. You're also going to get credits based on, um, 
every time you're paid at title, okay? So getting paid at title means um, when, once you're a lead consultant, let me pull this up too because I put this in the thing. So you guys really need to understand the compensation plan. So if you don't know what the compensation plan is, please let me know right now and I will briefly go over it for, for you with you guys. Like I don't care. Like you have to understand how the compensation plan works because if you don't know how the compensation plan works, how are you ever going to sponsor someone and teach them how the compensation plan works? You have to understand it. So in this packet anyway, which I'm going to go over with you and show you exactly what's in here, I have the compensation plan plant in here because you need to really understand how this works okay um, but basically this is the brand new one too by the way I love how they did this it's very pretty it's all color-coded it's much easier to understand and so basically um, where was I going with that I just had a reason why I was telling you that hold on let me pull up what did I just lose here oh this thing um, hang on okay that's what I wanted to do. Um, okay, so paid at title, that's what I was saying. So once you're a lead consultant, um, you, where is my compensation plan now? Here we go. Once you're a lead consultant, so you see you're certified, sell, you know, sell 1,000 PRV, once you're 1,000, you're certified for life, that's what it says. Then once you move up to lead consultant, these are your requirements. So just to give you guys an idea, if you don't know how the compensation plan works, this is how it works. This is your monthly requirements. In order to promote to your title or to get paid at your title, you need to have these monthly. And then if you do, these are the commissions that you get paid on. But let's say you promote to lead consultant. If you do not put in your 500, every month, you are not getting paid on your downline, okay? Um, so let's say you promote to lead consultant and your team is hitting these numbers, but you only are putting in 200, you're not gonna get paid on your downline. So that's why um, Sensi is giving you paid at title consistency credits, okay? So once you promote to once you promote to lead consultant, in order to get paid as a lead consultant, you have to make those numbers every month. Same thing for me. Every month I go back down to certified consultant. So in order for me to get paid as a director, I have to make my director numbers. Otherwise I get paid as a certified consultant. So that's why when they say that these are pyramid schemes and that you know all the people at the top make the money, no, all the people at the top have to hustle just as hard because we go back to certified consultant. We are all literally have the same opportunities here, okay? So this is just to give you an idea. As a... Um, you know, a, just an idea, lead, a lead consultant, in order to promote to, to lead, you need 500 PRV in one month, okay? Um, you would have to sponsor one person who is active. Now, being active is selling 200. So let's say you bring them on, they have to get active, and then you guys together um, need to sell 1,000 GWV. GWV is group wholesale volume, and group wholesale volume is 75% of your PRV together. So technically, it would be 1330 or something like that between the two of you that you would have to sell in order to get that. But you don't have to worry about that math because if you go on your performance tab, you'll see that there. You'll see where your GWV is and how far you have to go, okay? So in order to get to lead, you need that, all right? And then in order to continue getting paid at lead, you have to meet this every single month. Same thing, if you, if you wanna to promote to start, you'd have to start recruiting more, have two active frontline, you know, 2,500 GWV, uh, you having the 500, and then you'd move up to start. And then to continue getting paid at start, you'd have to keep that or, or go above it, all right? So that's just to give you an idea how that works and why the compensation plan is like that. So for here, your paid at title consistency means every month that you get paid at title or above, at least five out of six months, you're gonna get 2,500 credits, which is amazing. So come December, January is probably when you'll see those credits, okay? Um, because you have to wait at least five months that you're paid at title. They don't have to be consecutive, but they do have to be consistent. So any five out of those six months that you're paid at your title, you have the 2,500. Um, entry title is a title at the beginning of the incentive qualification period. So that's basically like if you're a lead consultant right now, you have to get paid lead consultant five out of six months. If you're a star consultant right now, that would be considered your entry title. Your title at the beginning, okay? Um, so here, paid entry title, monthly. So every month that you are this, um, every month that you're paid at your title, 
and you are this title at the beginning of the qualification period, this is what you're going to get per month. So if you're a lead consultant right now, and every single month over the next six months that you get paid to your title, you're going to get 300 per month. If you're a star consultant, every month that you're a star consultant, you're going to get 400 per month and so on. Okay. So that's really, really awesome. So that's three, six, nine, twelve. Uh, 15. So that's 1800 credits that if you are a lead consultant, you know, over the next six months you'd ha and you got paid to your title, you have 1800 credits at the end of that. So you can really see how the credits start to stack up. Okay. Um, and then superstar director, which we're not, none of us are there yet, but if you get 5,000 credits for that. Um, consistency. So this is really amazing. I love this. So 500 PRV. Um, if you sell 500 PRV, five out of six months, you're gonna get 2,500 credits at the end of the qualification period. So again, in December or January, 500 PRV. Why is Sensi doing that? Because we have an amazing compensation plan, right? That, you know, in order to get paid to your title, you need to have 500. So Sensi is recognizing that positive reinforcement right there by, you know, making sure that you are getting paid at your title and also getting paid on your downline by doing so. And if you're working towards, you know, earning that, where did my thing go? Um, you know, you can, you're going to get 2,500 for every time you're consistent with 500, five out of six months. Okay. Sensational, sensational start. So this is new since he's never done this before. So let me take a sip of wine. So sensational start. So this is, um, you're going to get credits if you earn sensational start or if you, you sponsor someone and they earn sensational start. Okay. So sensational start, let's say you're a new consultant. Now you're within your 70 days. Um, as long as your 70th day, like the day that it ends happens during the qualification period, you'll get credits for it. Um, Sensi did say that if it goes past January 31st, 2018, there's nothing that they can do about it. They cannot extend that. So that means if you sponsor someone in, let's say, January, their 70th day is not going to end on January 31st. It's going to go past. So you have to just be aware of that, okay? Um, but if their 70th day is during the qualification period, you, they will get credits and you will get credits, okay? So sensational start level one. If you earn level one, you're going to get a thousand credits. Level two, two thousand. Level three, three thousand. And then for if whoever you sponsor, if you sponsor someone and they earn level one, you get five hundred credits. Level if they earn level two, you get a thousand credits, and if they earn level three, you get two thousand. Now I don't even think any. Do any of you know what the qualifications are for um, sensational start? Because I'll tell you, before I printed this out. Um, earlier yesterday, actually, I didn't know what the qualifications were for sensational start. They recently revamped this. Okay. So don't, I want you guys to don't think that I'm like, you know, miss know it all either. Like there are things that I have to make sure I look up to, to, to double check. Okay. So this is where you're going to find that out business references. And then you're going to search sensational, um, start. You know what? Actually, you're going to, sorry, you're going to search shooting star and sensational start. So you see this sensational start and shooting star award. This is an amazing new document that Sensi has here. You guys, it's so amazing. Okay. I love this because it talks about sensational start and shooting star based on the six skills of the selling system. So that party with a purpose that Sensi has been talking about. These are the six skills of the selling system that are going to help you promote in your business, grow your business, expand your business, meet people, blah, blah, blah. Okay. So this document, just to FYI, is going to help you reach sensational start and shooting star based on all of these things here. So I love this document because you need to know what sensational start is. If you are sponsoring people in order to helping them learn sensational start, you have to understand what those qualifications, qualifications are. You also need to understand what those qualifications are. Even if you're not doing it for the incentive, if you're bringing on new team members, you have to understand how it works in order to help them reach sensational start. Okay. So if you go to this document, and I put this in this thing too, you guys. But if you go to this document, it'll show you what the hell. It sounds like there's like a heart beating or something like that. Um, okay, so if you go to Sensational Start, oh, I'm sorry. If you go to this document on the second page, you'll see a chart here with the qualifications for Sensational Start. In order for somebody to earn Sensational Start, 
within their 70 days, they have to sell at least 1500 PRV or 500 PRV and one person who they sponsor who reaches active, okay, in 70 days. And then you can see here, same thing for level two, it's 3000 PRV or 1500 and one person. And then level three is 6000 PRV or 3000 and two um, people who reach active. So it's very important for you to know this. And this is why I put this in the trip trip earners guide for you because you have to understand how sensational start works if you want to coach somebody into earning it okay and even for you if you're in your 70 days you have to know what your goal is if you don't know what you're shooting for it's just like up in the air so i would definitely um at some point or another because inside this like trip earner guide i only put in the second page for you but this is a very useful document and this is a side note like this is kind of irrelevant to what we're talking about but definitely look at this when you can because look at this it gives you ideas on how to earn sensational start and shooting start by home parties basket parties fairs and shows fundraisers like it talks about all this stuff then it talks about prospecting what is prospecting you know complete your list of 100 talk to people ask your families then it talks to you about booking how do you do book you know how do you book parties it talks to you about hostess coaching do you guys know i literally have never done hostess coaching the whole two years that I've been with Sensi, I've never hostess coached my, my hostesses ever. And so when I was pulling this up yesterday, because I was putting this together for our team hangout, I actually came across this document and I was like, oh my God, this document is so amazing. And I knew that Party With A Purpose talks about all this stuff, but I never actually thought to coach my hostesses. And I know it's important. I've just never done it. So um, I, you know, anyway, so I was looking on here and I actually did this today with my, I dropped off a hostess packet. This is kind of irrelevant. I dropped a hostess packet to my, uh, one of my hostesses that I have this month. And I actually did this. I did the steps of hostess coaching and you know, I, I met with her and then I told her I'm going to be sending her her link in two days. And then in like another three days, we're going to check in. Like it actually gives you a plan for hostess coaching, which I was like, this is like amazing. So either way you need to figure out party with a purpose regardless. So if you are coming with me to Boston, for those of you attending the Boston one, like I can't wait, it's going to be amazing. But anyway, that's a uh, total side note, but this document has tips and ideas. It even tells you what to put in your hostess packet. Okay. It gives you um, ideas on presenting, setting up your display, giving everyone a wish list at the party, talk about each category, blah, blah, blah. It talks to you about following up, how to follow up with customers, help them with their order forms, review their wish list, blah, blah, blah. These are, and then sponsoring it gives you ideas on how to sponsor new consultants. Okay, with like an idea of a, of a possibility packet with some information to put in there. This document is gold, gold. Okay, so I would definitely look this up on your own time and just review it because even me, two years later, just got some takeaways from this document. So it's amazing. But most importantly, you need to understand how Sensational Start works if you want it, um, you know, towards earning your trip and helping your consultants that you're bringing on. Okay. So again, these are the credits. So I just wanted to make sure you guys understood Sensational Start. Um, and then the lastly is of empty tenants. So if you did go to reunion this year, you got 2000 credits. So those are types of perks that you get for going to Sensi Family Reunion. So Anaheim, California, we got to have some red people registered put it in the comments and let me know if you are going to sense family reunion next year even if you don't know if you're gonna go like if you want to go whatever i would definitely register um so that's pretty much like how the qualifications work okay so inside this trip earners guide i have i'll pull it up here actually um where is it it's trip earners manual okay so this is basically i'm gonna upload this on the files tab of our team page after we get off this call okay it's one document uh all you have to do is print it out okay um so this is basically what i did and then just to fyi if you guys want to do this you don't have to put it in this thing but i got these um clear report covers on amazon so it's just basically like a report cover and then it has oops it has like a clear front if you just search report cover on amazon i got them pretty inexpensive i got it as like an add-on item um but it has like this little like you know you just hole punch it and then you just hold it in there so um i put those in there or you could just staple it you could put it in a folder however you want to do it but this i told all the girls who came to the team hangout the other day you need to carry this with you at all times during the next six months so print this document out this is exactly what i gave them there print it out, keep it on you over the next six months because this is going to help you earning the incentive. If you're going by this incentive, hoping to earn it by the edge of your seat, 
you're not going to earn it. Okay. So you have to have a plan, print this out. So basically this is what it is. It's a cover photo, whatever. Then I gave you guys some like little quotes and stuff to keep you kind of motivated throughout the next six months. Cause I, I'm like a, I love like quotes. I feel like they, you know, when you see them, it just, I don't know. I just love that. So anyway, so I put your trip qualification, um, in here. So you'll have that. So you can always refer to see how many credits you need. And that's everything that we just went over. Um, and then, whoops, I just went too fast. Sorry. Um, credits and then here. So this is your incentive tracker. Now you might have already printed this out on your workstation, but you can find it on your workstation. Um, and basically what you want to do is come up with a game plan. So the top is basically a, like what you project you're going to be able to do over the next six months. And then the bottom is what you actually did. Okay. So, um, Jennifer Anderson, by the way, on our team page, she posted, well, I think I posted it or she posted it. Um, but it's her trip plan that she had created for every title that you are. So whether you're a certified consultant, star consultant, it was just like a trip plan. And she gave two trip plans per title. So depending if you earned, uh, if you promoted, there was a trip plan. And if you didn't promote, there was a trip plan. So I would base this trip plan based upon you know, not counting on the fact that you're going to promote because you don't know if that's going to happen. So if you're expecting to get points based on your promotion, then, um, and then you don't reach your promotion, you cannot earn the credits that you're shooting for. So always base your trips, you know, giving yourself that little bit of wiggle room. Okay. Um, hang on. I just saw a comment real quick. I'm just going to stop this because I just saw something in the chat. Um, hold on. Wait one second explain the plan, please. Okay. Did I do that? I think I did that. I know you told me that if you don't, if you don't these goals, then you don't get the awards, but is there still opportunity to achieve others? Does that make sense if you don't get the goals? So shooting star, if you didn't earn shooting star, no, it's just, it's, past it. You don't, you don't get it. Unfortunately. Um, if you're, if you're within your 70 days, then yes, you do. They're sensi like they have like new consultant goals, but there's not really any like other goals past that other than like incentive trips, which is a big goal, you know, so they'll have things that happen like that. But as far as, um, those new consultant goals, no, unfortunately it's just the one time and yes, good. I'm so excited. Planning to register. I love all those planning to register. Okay. And yes, Jennifer Anderson's plans are like on point. So that's what I was saying. So if you, um, haven't seen them already, look up the trip plans on our team page that Jennifer Anderson posted because they are amazing. And it also gives you an idea to see what you should be shooting for, um, you know, as a consultant. So what you want to do. So for me, you guys, to be quite honest, I'm shooting for level four. Like I go big or go home. Like if I don't get it, like that's it. <laughs> like I need to be earning a trip for me and my husband. And you know what? I don't say, I hope I earn it. I say I'm going on that cruise and me and my husband are going to be on that cruise next year. Cause if you don't have that mindset, you're not going to earn it. You have to say, I'm going to get it and I'm going to try and I'm going to do it. Like that's it. If you automatically put that blinder that you can't again, it's, it's all met. It's automatically putting that like to stop you. Okay. So anyway, so for me personally, and I'll be real honest with you guys, if you are talking three to level four, you need to have high sales. You need to have at least at least 2000 PRV each month, if not more. Okay. Um, so for me, I'm shooting for 2000 PRV in August. That's like a goal, a personal goal that I have. Okay. So don't feel like this is something that you need to do. But for me personally, I'm shooting for 2000 PRV in August and then September, October, November, I'm shooting for 3000 PRV. And then December um, and January, I'm shooting for a thousand PRV each because in December too, you guys, just to FYI, it's like half a month because there's that um, shipping deadline. Like a, it's like, I think around the 17th or 18th, Sensi says have in your orders by this time in order to receive it for Christmas. So it's basically like half a month because after that you're on Christmas break, like you're not really doing much, your customers are not ordering. So December tends to be a much smaller month. So that's why my goals are a little bit smaller, but I will tell you from September, October, November, November is our best month all the time. Like it's literally like hustle mode. I mean, from September on, but November is always going to be your best. So 
me personally, like I said, if you are looking to earn levels three and four, you need to have top sales. So when I say 2000 PRV and up, I know a lot of you might be like, oh, I can't do 3000 PRV. How am I going to do that? You can do that. You're going to do that with a plan. You're going to look at your calendar. You're going to see the date that you're available to party and you're going to book home parties. That's what you're going to do. Because I'll tell you guys, I could easily get to 2000 PRV with one to two home parties without a doubt. Home parties are where it is at because they need to smell it. They see it in front of them. If you have the products there for them to look at, they're going to want it. There's no doubt about it. They're going to a party to shop. They're invited to a Scentsy party and they know that they're there to buy something. Then we have amazing things like combine and save packages that help you upsell and talk, you know, it's, it's, and, and then if you have like a diffuser, oh my gosh, put a diffuser on display. Like I don't think I've ever not sold a diffuser having it on display. So, and these are things that I would be more than happy to coach coach you guys on, okay? If you say to me, I'm having trouble booking parties and I really need some advice, I'd be more than happy to kind of help you come up with a game plan, okay? So I just want you to know that like 2000 PRV is very easy if you know how to go about it. So the first thing I want you guys to do, um, like when we get off this call and every month at the end of the month, like within like the last two weeks of the month, you have to front load your calendar. Okay. So this is very important into earning an incentive. Front loading your calendar means looking at your calendar two, two months out and, and scheduling your days. Okay. So I highlight my days that I'm available to I'm available to party. Orange is usually my family and personal days. If I have doctor's appointments, like this this month is my, my husband and I's anniversary, so I blocked off from like the 12th to the 14th. Um, you know, I, I anything that's personal, family, like you have to like kind of block that out, get that out of the way, put that on your calendar, and that's that. Everything else in between that you are available needs to be a party day, okay? And when you're following up with people, you have to give them those dates. Okay. Cause I find a lot of times too, you know, people will be like, Oh, so let me know a day that works for you. If you leave it up to your hostess to give you a day and get back to you on when, when's a good time for them, they're not going to want to book the party or this, they're just never going to end up doing it because time's going to pass. It's going to be overwhelming. They're going to have to think about all this stuff. And so you really want to make sure you knuckle down um, and give them days. Like even if my whole calendar is open, I'll say to them, um, you know, I'll be like, Oh, I have the 11th, um, 13th and 14th, let me know which works for you. And I'm giving them actual dates to pick from. All right. But anyway, I'm not going to get into a whole thing about that because there's plenty of trainings on that. And then, um, like I said, if there, if you really want to do like a one-on-one, -on -one, I'd be more than happy to do that. Okay. Um, but you really, really need to front load your calendar, see what days you're available to party, use those days, actually book them and don't stop. So if you know your goals for the month and you say, okay, I have three party days this month, even if you have one party day, right? Like one day for a home party, that's the only time throughout the month that you could do. Make sure you don't stop until you get it booked. That's all that it is. Do not stop until it's booked, okay? And then I don't only do home parties, so I do a number of different parties. On Monday nights, I do Facebook parties, um, other than our first Monday, which I do a team call, but I do Facebook parties throughout the month. So that's another thing, too, on top of your home parties. I also try and have a few basket parties out throughout the month. You know, sometimes if somebody doesn't want to book a home party, I might say to them, well, have you ever thought of a pouch party? I can send you some sense. You could take it with you on the go, blah, blah, blah. Um, the those are going to be really good too. And it's also ensuring in case one of them doesn't hit the host's space or maybe they cancel or whatever. At least you have that out. But it has to be a number of parties. It cannot just be one party, two parties. It has to be like a combination of different parties. Okay. So between that, right now on my calendar to give you an idea, I have one, two, three home parties this month. I have one, two Facebook parties. Typically I do four. Um, and then I actually have two Facebook or two pouch parties out. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven parties going this month, you guys. Okay. And I'm only, only three of them are actually taking up my time other than like a Facebook party, which is nothing for me. It's like a quick Facebook live at, in, you know, at night, but like my home party is really going to be the thing that's going to be, I need to put on my calendar and make sure I have space for it. So make sure you look at when you can do parties and and do multiple, multiple parties. All right. Um, so that's really how you're going to front load, front load your calendar and get yourself to 2000 PR because it is possible. And you're going to see during the fall, people are going to be buying extra. They're going to be buying gifts. So when your PRV is normally 500, it's going to be a thousand during the fall. When your PRV, if your PRV is normally like 1000, 2000, it might even be three, $4,000 during the fall. 
my very best PRV that I had was last year, last November, I was almost, it was like over 4,500 PRV. It was insane, like literally insane. And that's because I had a lot of parties in my calendar, but people were buying so much. It was ridiculous. So the reason why I say that to you guys is because I want you to know how amazing Scentsy Fall is. And two, I want you to know that it is possible with a little bit of planning. Okay. Um, so again, that's your PRV. Um, you have to automatically assume you're getting paid at title. With your consistency credits here, it should automa automatically be assumed you're getting 2,500 credits at the end of the month because if you sell 500 or more PRV, five out of six months, 2,500. So put that on there, 25 or 500, 500, 500, 500, 500, 500, and then at the end you get uh, 2,500 credits. Have it in your head. You're going to be getting paid at title, five, five, or you're going to be selling 500 PRV, five out of six months. Why are you putting that on there? Because that's your goal. That's what you're going to be shooting for because you want the credits for that. So you have to say, I am going to be selling 500 PRV. It's without a doubt. Like that should easily be on your radar. Um, your frontline certified. So obviously the people who you sponsor, um, you know, you cannot control who joins your team. But you can control how many conversations you're having. So you need to make it a point that you are sharing the business opportunity like a maniac throughout the, throughout the qualification period, okay? And what I did was in this little um, packet here that you're going to print out, I gave you this. So let me scroll down a bit. Um, I gave you a list of 100, okay? And what I want you to do is highlight 60 name or up to 60. The reason why I want you to hide up to 60 is because you're going to think of 60 recruits over the next six months. <laughs> and you guys are probably like, what? Like, no, let me tell you, you're going to break this down easy. You're going to think of 10 people a month that you can share the business opportunity with. And if you share the business opportunity with 10 people a month, okay, they say that one out of every 10 people will say yes. So if you share the business opportunity with 10 people a month over the next six months, that is six possible new recruits for you, okay? Which would then equal, oops, where did it go? I just had it. Um, come on. I hate when my computer does this. Ah, okay. It would equal 6,000 credits. So up at the top of your tracker, um, your frontline certified, I would put um, a six that like a thousand in each of them. Okay. So to, uh, to assume that you're going to have six recruits over the next six months by sharing the business opportunity with 60 people. Isn't that crazy? So you really need to try and think about 10 people per month. Okay. And I give you ideas on how to do this. Um, so this document here, there's something in here is called ideas that work to help you earn the 2018 fall incentive. Okay. I literally give you ideas on how you can do this. Hold a last chance first glance party in August. If you guys do not have a, a last chance first glance party on your calendar this month, you're doing something wrong. I'm sorry. You have to have a last chance first glance party because you there's nothing saying that you can't throw a party every single month for yourself. Why can't you throw a party for yourself? Put it on your calendar. Like I have mine set for August 27th. It's actually going to be an open house where people come in my house and I'm showing them all the things that they can get this month before they discontinue last chance. And I'm also giving them a sneak peek of the new catalog, um, you know, for the fall. Do that. You can do that. Who says you can't throw a party for yourself? Even if, I mean, I don't agree with doing things on, like parties on Facebook because again, you know, sense is the type of thing that you need to smell, but really like hold a last chance first glance party. Even if you have to do it on Facebook, but do have a party or invite your best customers over. Um, throw a fall catalog release party. Guys, we have a new catalog coming September 1st. Throw a party before it. Have a catalog launch party, you know, you can do that. Create a six month hostess of the month club. And I give you ideas on how you can do that. I'm not going to go too much into that because I want to stay on topic, but here is, I give you literally uh, an, ex an explanation of how the hostess of the month club works, but that's like added PRV. If you have a, a hostess of the month club going, that's an added 200 PRV every month. If you have multiple going, that's even more, okay? Um, offer your new consultants. Once they join, um, give them an incentive. So for when I have new consultants, I give them an incentive. If they reach certified consultant within 30 days of them, them enrolling, I give them a free set of mini testers. The reason why I do that is because if they reach certified within 30 days of enrolling, more than likely they're hitting their shooting star. And when they hit their shooting star, you earn a $25, you earn $25 product credit. I didn't know if you guys knew that. So when you sponsor someone, 
when they hit shooting star, you get $25 from Sensi to spend on anything you want. What I do is I take that $25 and I invest it back into my business and I invest it back into them and I give them a free set of mini testers. And it's a little incentive to get them to help them to certify because they say when someone certifies, it helps them all the more, you know, early rather, if they certify early, it helps them more be more successful in their business. So you want to make sure they're getting certified. It's going to help them and it's also going to count towards your credits um, for when they certify, okay? Um, create a list of 60 potential recruits over the next six months. Like I said, we already talked about that. Book six vendor events over the next six months. Try and book one vendor event a month. You know how many contacts you'd be meeting if you had one event a month throughout the, the fall season? And fall and winter is crazy for, for fall and craft show fairs and things like that. Um, work the 50-10 rule. So this is what I was going to talk about. So when you're creating your list of 60 recruits and you have 10 people per month, you need to be giving them information. So the 50-10 rule is basically at the beginning of every month, you create 50 samples. Okay? Make a date for it, a couple hours, put it on your calendar, and just dedicate like a couple hours to making samples. Make 50 samples, whether you do felt samples, wax samples, wash lift samples, whatever. Um, have 50 of those and then you also make 10 opportunity packets okay if you want to know what what those are there's plenty of trainings on our team page if you just search opportunity packet there's lots of ideas on YouTube there's also to you guys a really great group from um, our SSD Kristen Ingalls and um, superstar director Chloe Cox and Maggie Hensley they have a really really good group called boss babe basics so if you are not on that group you need to get on it so search on our team page for boss babe basics and that'll come up and um there is they literally break down it's a six-week program that they have where it's like a video videos you can watch on their youtube channel that literally go over all this stuff opportunity packets and all that so the 50 10 rule um so 50 samples 10 opportunity packets in the beginning of the month and then you your goal is to have it out by the end of the month okay um and put it by your door have it somewhere where, where you reminded of it every day but if you do that every month if you pass out 50 samples and you pass out 10 opportunity packets every month there is no reason why your business would not grow you guys absolutely not why do i keep getting these little things on the screen i don't know why that's doing that um and i know we're kind of going past time here so we're almost done um update your list of 100 i gave you guys that Hold a booking blitz. Um, if you have a team, hold a booking blitz with your team. If you don't have a team yet, that's okay. You can, you know, see if maybe we'll do a booking blitz over the next six months, or you can even do your own booking blitz. Carry your testers everywhere you go over the next six months. Um, have a goal to book at least one party from the parties that you're booking. Um, so that is always a goal that I try at all my parties. I always make sure to try and get at least one party booked um, because Parties, again, are the bread and butter of your business. Book multiple parties throughout the month like we talked about and following up. Okay, so this is just a little document with some ideas on how to earn um, the incentive. And so when you're using your tracker, you know, you kind of have an idea of what you're doing. Your monthly paid at title credits, um, if you're whatever title is now, that should be like determined out. Your paid at title consistency, whatever. If you guys, um, you know, if you don't understand how this tracker works, please let me know and I'd be more than happy to go over this with you and help you come up with your own personalized trip plan. And I'm dead serious about that. Like if you guys want me to help you come up with a trip plan, I'd be more than happy to do that. But you have to let me know because I will not know. Okay. Um, and then also FYI, um, Sensi said that toward the end of August, there's going to be a scent of tracker on our home screen, like on the home screen of your workstation. There's usually a tracker there too, but it's good to have your own tracker. So you have a set of goals too. Okay. Um, and then I put the compensation plan in there for you to know, because you need to know that and you need to know as you bring on team members, they're going to need to know it. Okay. Um, and then same thing with sensational start. Like we talked about, everything's there. And so that way you could tell your teamies, um, there the list of 100 and then you know what I also did I put in this too so this is kind of irrelevant to our incentive but this is also really good for you to keep track so Sensi has what's called annual sales and annual mentor and it's basically an award that happens from May 1st to April 30th so we're already in the qualification period for it it started in May so it ends next April and the reason why I put this in here is because you get um, for every person who you sponsor from May to April 30th, if they reach certified consultant, you get 
$25 for each person who reaches certified consultant. If they reach lead consultant, you get $50 for each person. The nice thing about this is that it's a minimum of $350 bonus. So if you get all 14 at the end of the year, Sensei will give you $350 cash money in your paycheck. The, um, but that's like minimum. If you sponsor more people than that, then the money only grows from there. Okay. And then the sales, if you have 30,000 PRV, but you know, in this whole, you know, in the month or in the year, rather, um, it's a thousand dollar bonus that Sensi gives you in May too. cash money in your paycheck, a thousand dollars. So you could literally have $1,350 cash money in your paycheck if you earn these awards in one year. And it's really amazing. They're very like prestigious awards. So if you earn them, it means like you're top notch. Like you'll walk to stage at reunion. Like it's amazing. But they give you this little breakdown and it tells you in order to earn like let's say annual mentor, they give you a goal of like a weekly PRV of 625 and then a monthly on average 2,500 PRV every month if you're looking to earn annual sales. But anyway, so the reason why I put this in here is because the recruits that you sponsor over the next six months during the qualification period are also going to count towards annual awards. So it's good for you to keep track on that too. Okay. Just to FYI. And then the very last thing that I put in here is the um, incentive trip fact, because you're going to have to refer to, if you have a question about the incentive, all of it's going to be in here. This is where you're going to see all that. Okay. So this document, like I said, I'm going to upload it to the files tab of our group on real consultants. So you'll be able to print it out, but definitely keep it with you. And, um, you know, over the next six months. And again, if you want me to help you come up with an individualized trip plan, please let me know. Um, there's also the trip plans, like I mentioned from Jennifer Anderson on there too. Okay. Oof. Okay. So we literally just went over a lot. So let me, um, just go back here. Does anybody have any questions? If you have any questions, now is your time to shine. If I will answer, so let me know. Take a sip of my wine while I wait. Because I know I literally just like rambled um, through everything. So, do you guys feel confident? I want to see thumbs up. Everybody feel confident? Yes? Are we going to earn a cruise? <laughs> we are going to earn a trip, you guys. It's so amazing. So I'm going to end this with letting you guys know that Sensi trips are literally like no other trip you've been on. And once you go on a Sensi trip, you're going to be like, I'm never going to travel any other way. Like you almost become a snob to traveling because you do not want to travel any other way besides with Sensi. And I wish that Laura Colon was on here because I know that she went to Punta Cana with me. It's amazing. You get like room drops every night. They treat you like royalty. There's um, like in Punta Cana, they had this barefoot on the beach party with like endless amounts of like gourmet food that was put out. And it's just so amazing. And I really would love to see each and every one of you experience a Sensi incentive trip. Because when I earned Disney, you guys, and I told you I earned it in three months, like I was like, I'm not going. Cause when I first earned it, I was like, Oh my God, I earned it. But then I had also planned on going to Disney in September. And I remember saying to myself like, Oh, I'm so excited. I earned it. And then I was like, I'm not going to Disney without my kids. Like, how could I do that? There's no way. Um, but then Jennifer Anderson, when I was talking with her, she's like, you earned a sense incentive. You need to go on this trip. And then sure enough, when I did, and I was able to go and we took my family, like it was so amazing. And I was so happy that I went. So all of your hard work is going to be well paid off and well rewarded um, from Sensi through this incentive trip. And you're just going to, when you're on it, you're going to be like, yeah, I worked my butt off and it was amazing. And I freaking deserve this because it's, it's truly amazing. Okay. So I'm excited. You guys got to be excited, excited. Keep up your momentum throughout these next six months, especially as fall happens. It's going to get crazy. You might feel like you're going to get burnt out at times. Like I'll be honest, by the time holiday season rolls around, I'm like, oh, I don't even want to do sensey things anymore. Like I'm so done with sensey things. So you're going to have moments like that, but it's okay to have moments like that. That's why just a real quick, I want to show you what I put in here. I know I ramble. Let, the last thing that I put here for you guys to read is if you get tired, learn to rest and not quit. Okay. Cause that's most important. If you say to yourself, I'm so burnt out. Like I don't even want to talk about fancy anymore. I cannot do this. That's okay. Take a freaking break. Take a few days off if you have to, but come back into it full swing. Okay. I love you guys. I'm so excited. And thank you all so much for jumping on this call again.
Um, Laura is my cousin. Oh, Ashley. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Laura is my cousin. She gave me the motivation just by seeing my success. Yes. So you have a really great person to learn from too, because Laura is a hustler and she earned herself Punta Cana. And so I know for sure she's going to help you get there too. So that's amazing. Yes. Sensi is no joke and trips are no joke. So anyway, thank you guys so much for being on the call. I'm so excited that each one of you are here. Um, we have over 118 consultants in our group and there's probably one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of you on here. So that just goes to show you who wants to earn a trip, right? So either way, I'm excited for you guys and um, let me know if you guys need anything. I have any questions. Okay. Bye.